We're on the Tillicum Bridge. We've got two models, uh, Nicole Nance and Jessica Boyle. We're running late by exactly one hour, so we're going to try to compress uh, what we hoped we could do in an hour into probably about 30 minutes. I do portraits and fashion and creative photography. A typical day, I get home from work and I meet with somebody else, or I'll be editing, or I'll be planning, um, or I'll be shooting. I am an artist, I mean, I draw. This is just an extension of what I would normally be doing with a pen and paper, but it's just so much easier because I don't have to spend all the time drawing it. I can get people and we can go to places and we get makeup artists and designers um, and models, of course, to, to make this vision come real. Okay, I want to take five minutes to do something that we would absolutely not do in these dresses. My usual thing is they'll find a person. It might be somebody walking down the street, it might be somebody I see on Facebook, somebody might approach me and I go, there's something there, there's something behind this person, and then we'll sit and we'll talk, and I'll, I will always sit and talk. Not only because it helps me understand how this person acts and reacts and what they look like and what are their good angles, and, um, but it helps me understand what, what are their stories because everything we do is the story of the person that we're shooting. I mean, what we're doing is, it is absolutely collaboration. It, I would not come up with these ideas if the uh, model didn't have these characteristics or thoughts or, or, or past or that sort of thing. It's literally based on their experiences. Honestly, most of the people I shoot with have PTSD. So these, these stories with strength that you see are stories of not only being broken, but recovering um, and re-emerging from what they've been through as this like, bigger person. And when you do see that, I think that's what brings the strength to my pictures. There's a lot of people that can pose, but, this, but the strength really comes from that person's experiences and learning how to build uh, their own protections and rebuild their capacity to love. Elbow out just a little bit. Yep.